Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the area of a hexagon if we are only given the apothem. So here we have only been given the apothem, which is the distance from the side of the hexagon to the center, and that is 6. The first thing you want to do in order to find the area is divide this hexagon into triangles. Basically, to do this, just draw a line from the center to each of the corners. So we'll have a line here, 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 and here. That gives us six triangles. Now, because this is a regular hexagon, all of our side lengths are exactly the same. This means that all these triangles will also be exactly the same. So if we can find the area of just one of these triangles, we can multiply that by 6 because we have 6 triangles to find the area of this hexagon. But how do we find the area of this triangle? Well, first of all, if we have 6 triangles and we have 360 degrees all the way around in the circle, if we divide that by 6, we get 60. This means that each one of these triangles has this corner length of 60 degrees. And if we went all the way around, we'd have 60, 120, 180, 240, 300, and 360. But if we look at this triangle here, we have split it up not just to this triangle, but to two smaller triangles with this line here. That means that if we just take one of these triangles here, so say this side, this is only 30 degrees because it would be half of the 60. And we have our 6 apothem here, so this side length here is 6. That means we can find this side length here using trigonometry. So let's just call this side length x. Because this is opposite over adjacent, we have tan of 30 is equal to x over 6. If we multiply both sides by 6, we get x equals 6 tan 30. And if you type that into your calculator, you'll get x is equal to 3.5 rounded. Now, remember, this x here is only half of this triangle. So if we went all the way across, it would be double this. So this entire length is actually 3.5 times 2, which is 7. This means that now, not only do we know the height of this triangle here is 6, but we also know that the base is 7. We can now use the formula to find the area of this triangle. The formula for the area of a triangle is 1 half base times height. So we have area is equal to 1 half base, which is 7, times our height, which is 6. That gives us our area to be 1 half times 7 times 6, which is 42. And 1 half of 42 is 21, meaning the area of this triangle is 21. So we have now found the area of this triangle here. But remember, we have 6 triangles total. So if we times our area of this triangle by our total number of triangles, which is 6, we will get the area of our entire hexagon. So 21 times 6 is 126. So our area of this hexagon is 126, whatever unit you're using, say centimeters squared. And that's how you find the area of a hexagon if you're given the apothem.